In June 1944, as World War II raged across the globe, the United States Navy established a specialized photographic squadron, which would later be known as Patrol Squadron 61. This unit, essential to the war effort in the Pacific, was initially based in San Diego, California, and equipped with aircraft specifically modified for reconnaissance missions, including the Liberator and Hellcat. The squadron, after intensive training in California, was relocated to Barbers Point, Hawaii, in September 1944. Under the fleet, Air Wings Command, they commenced a series of critical reconnaissance missions. One of their pivotal assignments involved photographic flights over the Japanese-held islands of Chichijima and Hajima. By the end of 1944, the squadron had moved its base of operations to Guam, focusing on strategic reconnaissance over the Bonin Islands in Iwo Jima. The early part of 1945 saw the squadron broaden its scope to include aerial reconnaissance over other key areas in the Pacific, such as Truk, Poluat, and Wolai. This expansion of operations was further supported by the addition of the Dauntless to their fleet. Notably, during this period, the squadron was also briefed on a significant objective in Naha, Okinawa. The mission over Okinawa, a crucial battleground in the Pacific War, was a testament to the squadron's strategic importance in gathering intelligence and aiding Allied forces in their military efforts. The squadron's activities continued relentlessly until the conclusion of World War II in September 1945. Their dedicated and efficient reconnaissance work provided invaluable intelligence to the Allied forces, aiding considerably in strategic operations across the Pacific. The squadron's efforts in capturing detailed photographic data, especially in critical areas like Okinawa, were instrumental in the success of the Allied campaign. As the war drew to a close, the squadron's contribution to the war effort, marked by their precise and effective reconnaissance missions, solidified their legacy as an integral part of the United States Navy's wartime operations.
Much obliged you hopped on board for this snazzy trip through American life in the 1940s and 1950s, all captured through nifty vintage photographs. If this flick's got your motor running, don't be a square. Click on that jolly bucket of bolts to subscribe to the channel for more top drawer content just like this.